Darwin was way more into worms than finches. While he is remembered for observations of bird beaks, the animal that, quote, absorbed his whole soul was the earthworm. One of his first publications, as well as his last book, were all about them. And it was Darwin who wrote about how those worms could literally restructure the earth. He studied a field that he knew had been topped with a layer of mineral deposit called marl 80 years before. In the time since then, all that marl had become buried by 12 to 13 inches of rich soil thanks to earthworms. The worms would burrow down under the marl in circumstances like dry weather, and they came up to the surface again after rain. This meant that they were eating dirt at lower layers and pooping it out above, thus shifting the marl lower and producing fertile soil at the top. The whole process was fascinating to Darwin, which is why 